is said in the scripture yogi yagya valkya there is a book hiranyagarbha yogasya bhakta who is teaching this yoga is taught by god himself who is teaching this yoga who is the teacher really never think a human being can be a teacher be very clear never think a human being can be a teacher god is the teacher you'll say swami ji it creates confusion why we know that they are the teachers okay you think of this flat roof and when there is rain the rain drops fall on the roof and there are outlets for rain water to fall there are outlets for rain water to fall in the outlet for a palace or artistic building what they have done at one place there is mouth of a lion there is a mouth of cow there is mouth of a tiger mouth is open and the rain water is falling out of the mouth am i clear and a child is looking and telling my mother come 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 water is falling from the mouth of the tiger another child is telling no no water is falling from the mouth of the cow the mother said my children don't get these ideas water is falling from heaven water is falling from heaven falling from heaven is passing through the mouth of some toys or some yeah, how to say this stone tiger or bricks tiger that's all they are not real tiger the meaning is never think an individual is teaching or it is it is all their thoughts or god's thought god is teaching nobody else and that is why it is said if a teacher is not directing the student to be united with god don't follow that teacher if a teacher is not turning your mind towards god and he tells follow me follow me don't follow him the teacher should direct the student towards tell me towards god not towards himself and not that you follow me be my slave be directed towards god and love him you are god's child that is your real relationship <laughs>